What's going on guys? We're right here in Corona, California, just off the 91 freeway between Orange County and Corona at Corona West, an all age manufactured housing community. It's a great community for your family. Over the last year, we have brought in over 10 brand new manufactured homes. These homes sell very quickly. This one right here, Space 57, just closed escrow for around $200,000. This is a great buy in Corona West, in Corona, California. If you're tired of driving two hours to get to work to Orange County from the Inland Empire, this is a great community for you. You are gonna cut your drive in half. But we've brought in several beautiful homes they all have different architectural appeal. This home right here has board and bat, black trim lap siding. Over here, this home is parallel to the street. So we have the side facing the street. This is a beautiful champion American freedom home. But you can see we have the lap siding with the accent, the body, the white, the vertical siding, all the trim, these columns. These homes look sharp. Manufactured homes are built much better today than they've ever been built before. You can choose all the same modern options in a custom built, site built home. This home right here is three bedrooms, two bathrooms, split floor plan. We're gonna tell you so much. Make sure you stick it out till the end. If you're new to this channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button. We too are brand new manufactured homes used mobile homes and tiny homes on a regular basis. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. We appreciate all the love you can give by hitting that like button. Now let's go tour this beautiful American Freedom Champion manufactured home. All right, so we changed this home up a little bit. We tried to give us some curb appeal or we gave it curb appeal by adding the eyebrows right there with the columns it gives it a little bit better curb appeal more pop our customers this is one of our favorite things to do when you have the bedrooms up front you can add a box bay bay window there you have different options to choose when designing a brand new manufactured home so here's an example of your ship lap siding the two eyebrows with columns the lap siding between the columns other things that you could do is you can do board and bat siding, uh, vertical siding. You can mix and match the lap siding with the vertical siding and the board and bat. But this home looks great. We even have the 12 inch eaves on the front and on the side. If your lot allows you to have eaves, if the lot's large enough, then you should definitely add the eaves to the home. It protects the home a little bit. So it's nice on this home, we were able to keep or add the eaves in the hoods. And over here on the side, you can see that we painted the body of the home, this nice tan color. It's very popular here in all age communities in Southern California. And we did the vertical siding. So you can save a little bit of money if you don't have to do the lap siding all the way down we chose this nice white window trim you do have options on window trim so if you're designing a brand new manufactured home for your lot make sure you talk to your mh expert so you know what your choices are we've added this nice little door hood it's just enough to cover the landing and the steps so if it rains we do get some rain here in southern california not very much but we do get some rain so um, now we're coming back up to the front. Now the inside, so the two bedrooms, we actually have two, or the two windows up front, we actually have two bedrooms up front because this is a split floor plan, which makes better use of the square footage. You have the kitchen and the living room and dining room all open up together. There might even be a little bit of a breakfast bar in this home for those of you who like breakfast bars, but this is a great quality manufactured home. 
So now let's, let's go inside and take a look at this home. Let's turn the lights on here. So, so this is a really good size utility room. We've added these overhead uh, cabinets side by side and you have your hanging rod in the middle so you could hang your clothes if there's anything that you're getting out of the dryer that you need to hang and hang dry. Um, so you, again, you have different options. This is an option that we optioned in if you're looking to save money, then you could just have a wire rack there. So you do have a lot of different options. Now, this kitchen is one of my favorites. It's got, it has a lot of cabinet space. Maybe not a lot, but it's got plenty of cabinet space, especially by adding this kitchen island right here adding a kitchen island add a kitchen island whenever you can it's a way to get more storage more cabinet space we even have this ledge over here you can turn this into a little bit of a breakfast bar um, now champion out of chandler arizona actually does something a little bit different with their with their laminate countertops you can see they have a bull nose edging which is really nice Typically, we've toured some Fleetwoods um, and their, their countertops with their laminate is more squared, which still looks nice, but a lot of people like having this bull nose. So that's something that you're gonna get different with Champion than other manufacturers. They also build a really nice cabinet. This is a nice hardwood cabinet. You can choose from different options for your hardware. On this home, we chose the brush nickel, looks very nice. We even have this stainless steel two cell sink, which is a standard sink. If you have laminate countertops, then you're not gonna be able to do an undermount sink. So if you wanna do an undermount sink, which makes it easier to clean, then you'll need to upgrade into solid surface countertops or quartz countertops or granite countertops. And then you can also option in a, we put a single lever faucet, but you could do a gooseneck faucet. And so we chose this, this, I like this six inch backsplash. It looks very nice. It's a two tone and, you know, standard would be just the same material as the laminate countertops, but having that two tone with the tile backsplash six inches, looks really sharp it's a it's a good look so for just a little bit more money you can add the tile six inch backsplash and now these appliances one thing with all these manufacturers is they use great appliance manufacturers so these are all whirlpool stainless steel appliances i like how they kind of incorporated some of the black in there so it's not just all stainless steel but they use very nice, it's Whirlpool is a nice quality uh, appliance manufacturer. And over here we have this three door refrigerator with an ice and water dispenser. This is very nice. You have your refrigerator, you got plenty of room. Look at this, oops, you got plenty of room here. And then we also have this the freezer is down here so what's nice my refrigerator actually has the ice in here but it's nice having this door because you have more room in your freezer there we go so let's step back here a little bit look how spacious this is these cathedral ceilings really open up the home a lot of the homes today have eight foot flat or nine foot flat ceilings it raises the side walls um, you know by a foot and a half or so but then you have less room in the center of the home so having the cathedral ceiling definitely opens everything up 
I, I really appreciate and value cathedral ceilings. Nine foot flat ceilings look awesome as well. You can add a coffer ceiling in there. It's very trendy, um, or I should say modern. It's what's in today, popular choices. But you see how with this split floor plan, you just have a lot more room. There's no dead space. You don't have any hallways. So you maximize the square footage. Tell me what you think in the comment section. Do you prefer cathedral ceilings or nine foot flat? Now let's go check out bedroom two and three. You're gonna see that bedrooms two and three are very good size bedrooms. So if you have teenage kids and they wanna hibernate in their rooms, these rooms are good for them. You can see we have a little bit of a box bay. It kind of opens things up a little. You have that little nook, good size closets, but you can easily fit. You really can fit a king size bed in here. Now here is bedroom number two or three, which you take your pick. This one is a, just a tad smaller, but a queen size bed will fit very nicely. And then we'll go over here into the guest bathroom. This is your standard guest bathroom, laminate countertops. You still have the, the hardwood cabinets and your nice white sink. You have a medicine cabinet, your vanity light. And then remember, what do I always say? I always say, add that window over the bathroom shower. It allows more natural light, more ventilation. It's a nice feature to have add, and it's not very much. Now we're almost through with this. Remember, we appreciate it if you would like this video and tell us what you would like to see. We're here for you. We wanna help you make an informed decision when buying a new or pre-owned manufacturer mobile home or tiny home. So we're here to ed help educate you. We're here to answer your questions. So I just wanted to get that out there. You know, feel free, you could contact us, 866-720-2207, or you could just fill out click on one of the links in the description and fill out a contact form and you could speak to a MH expert for free. We do not charge you, but this is a nice size bedroom. You could fit your dressers, nightstands, and a nice king size bed. Well, I almost forgot. We, we gotta check out this walk-in closet. Here, check it out. It's a good size walk-in closet. And you know what I like is that it's the linoleum. This linoleum looks so nice. It's not your standard linoleum, it's linoleum planks. So if you ever have to re replace one of them, they're just square tiles. And they're so durable, very thick, low maintenance. You, it's, you, it's almost impossible to scratch, but this linoleum, I like that it's in the closet because you don't have to go in there and vacuum. So I like a hard floor in the closet. And now here is the bathroom. You have your nice his and her sink with the cabinets, the medicine cabinet, the vanity lights. And again, we have a 60 inch walk in shower with a window above it. So, we hope you enjoyed this addition to the Manufactured Housing Expert channel. If you have any questions, you know how to contact us, 866-720-2207. You can also check out homequestsales.com.